Hi guys, this is N6QW Pete, and I want to share with you the um, completion of the project where I erected my two element beam, which uh, was about a, a three month odyssey uh, in trying to determine the best way to approach this project. I'm using a spider beam rotating mast, a Yesu G450 bottom mounted rotator and a special build from uh, Mosley Electronics, uh, which is a two element beam known as the MP32-N. This uh, particular beam uses a drew an element from a TA32 and a reflect reflector from a TA32 Junior. So you're able to run full power uh, with the antenna. Uh, lots of problems in trying to get this uh, beam installed. Uh, much missing, missing information from the manufacturers. Uh, there are simple things like uh, routing of coax and uh, things such as choke ballons, uh, application of anti-corrosion compound. The uh, best way to uh, zero beat uh, the uh, Yesu rotator, uh, how you route the coax uh, down the mast, uh, they were all uh, virtually unknowns. Or, uh, as I was told, everyone knows that. Well, I sure didn't and it would be very helpful. There is no manual for the spider beam mast, although I did get a lot of help from uh, the factory. So uh, kind of a difficult project to take on unless you've been around the pole, haha, -ha, a bit. But anyway, it's successful uh, installation. Uh, we're at about 30 feet up and uh, it is rotated very nicely. I did uh, design a house bracket uh, to provide additional stability and um, the antenna, as you can see, is guide. Uh, I erected uh, my 40 meter dipole uh, below the beam, and I now find that uh, it affects the SWR. <clears throat> so I'm going to have to relocate the 40 meter dipole, but for the meantime, uh, I'll now have uh, all band operation on 80 through uh, 10 meters, uh, less 30 meters and 17 meters. So, anyway, um, we have a successful installation. I'm very happy to see that we now have a beam capability. Uh, didn't tell my neighbors anything, so I'm probably going to go through that uh, next round of things of having some neighbor complaints. But uh, 30 feet, uh, it's not a big aluminum structure, shouldn't be too obtrusive. So this is N6QW reporting on a success.